Welcome to Science on Saturday. This time from Bioshock Infinite. And what are we going to talk about? Well, it's actually pretty simple. <laughs> about uh, can a bot be useful or, you know, do you have smart bots? And I think Elizabeth in Bioshock Infinite actually proves that you can. And then you might say, yeah, 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 that's probably uh, bullocks. And you know what? I'd say the same thing before I play this game, because usually bots in games, not so smart, especially if they have to work with you. But Elizabeth is special. And I'm not mean special as in, you know, you're just, oh yeah, she looks pretty or that. Yeah, okay, she does, but, you know, she's, uh, she's very useful. And that's something you don't see a lot. Because most, uh, most, well, technically bots or NPCs are not that, uh, are usually not that, uh, not that good or helpful or smart in RPG, really. There's a lot of stuff in here. So, and... That's technically one of the things that I'm really, uh, uh, you know, wondering, like, how come that, you know, people in this, the developers in this game actually fucking managed to fucking uh, pull it off, you know? Oh. Dead now, bitch. Now, I don't have to protect Elizabeth. It's no fucking Resident Evil 4 where Ashley constantly like, Leon! And you're like, God damn it. You know? Elizabeth can take care of herself. You don't have to babysit her. Now, I'm not saying that nowhere in the story she'll be captured or shit like that. I won't spoil anything, but I'm just saying, you know, stuff might happen, you know, there is no guarantee it. So, another good thing that Elizabeth can do, she can open locked doors. So, Elizabeth, do your thing. Of course, you do need lockpicks for that, you know. Sometimes you need a certain amount. In this case, I needed three, and, well, I, I got that. And usually it means, you know, uh... Oh, and I got another lockpick, so, you know, technically it only costs two then. But it usually means you get money or items uh, or other stuff, you know, but usually it's worth it, you know. It might seem a bit steep, you know, with free lockpicks for one uh, door, you know, but it's uh, it's actually not a bad trade. But, you know, it's, it's one of the things that Elizabeth can do now. She also is, uh, she's a character with her own mind. She, uh, you know, if she doesn't like something you're doing, then she'll tell you. And sometimes that can have a huge impact. And, let's not forget, you can do this. And guess what? So can she. So she doesn't have to hold on to you, you know. It, it's technically very, I think, uh, Elizabeth is a very strong young woman, you know. She can do a lot on her own. Do that. Yep, I got it. Look at that. All the heroes. Oh, wait. Let's see. Let's loot. And technically, uh, Elizabeth likes to stick around, you know? And that's cool. Oh. RPG, really? I didn't know they had RPGs in uh, that time. But then again, what do I know? So, let's go. Oh. Oh, what the hell? Oh. Yeah, but... See? She gives me uh, a web... Oh! See? 
this is what she also does. She gives me a oh headshot. She gives me a fucking uh, sniper eyes. I didn't even have to find it myself. She finds it for me and then gives it to me. I mean, how cool is that? Have, have you ever seen a bot do that for you? Usually, you always have to find everything, do everything. Oh dear lord, really? Don't worry about it. They're gonna... Yeah, I'm not good with a sniper rifle, by the way, you know, like... Oh, you suck! Yeah, I know. Oh, wait. Just show your face. Ah, oh, don't worry about it. You know, if she can find uh, ammo or health, she'll let you know. Or better yet, she'll offer it. Nice! Look, there you go. I'm fucking running out of ammo. She says, hey, I've got ammo for you. And there she froze it. I'm almost dead. She froze health to me. I'm out of salt, which is technically the stuff that makes you use your, your powers. And then she'll give you that. I mean, how fucking awesome is that? I mean, that's probably one of the best things you can fucking expect from a, from a bot, you know? You don't have to babysit them. They'll fucking help you when they can. And, oh, let's see. No, don't run away. And they'll do their best to, oh, that guy got fucked up. Is that guy also missing his head? Yeah. Weird. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to switch back to my, uh, the carbine. Let's not uh, mistake this one with one in Titanfall. That one's a bit different. So. Let's enter the Hall of Heroes. Now, as you can see, in combat, Elizabeth is very, very, very useful. And I really like her uh, in that part, you know, as in, really, finally you got a bot that tags along with you and that is not fucking annoying, that is not fucking a bother to you, and that is not someone that drags you down, as in, oh, I need your help, I need you, I need, I need, no. George Washington, is it? Yeah, I'm not an American, but I know my American history. But then again, if you wouldn't recognize George Washington, then I'm like, what the fuck were you doing during history? Vending machine. Eh. Don't think, whoa, really? I think I wasn't paying attention just a moment ago. Oh, he got knives in the back, that's just uh, rude. But it's pretty, uh, it's pretty awesome, uh, I think, uh, dude, it's fucking weird bending over like that, like, well, I guess when you die, you don't really always pick the spot. There he is! Okay, terrible shooting on my part here. It's kind of weird, I'm kind of used to Titanfall at the moment, so I'm like, oh man, this goes much slower and weirder, and yeah. Still, it's not really an excuse, but... Our prophet, Father Comstock, Father Comstock. Of 7th Cavalry. And man, the Nazi son. Huh. I don't even remember the name. Put the road to fleet. Proved his word on the field that day. Okay. Slave? Is that you? You home? Let's see, she even has a light, so... Is it dark? Elizabeth will light the way, but... As you can see now, look, I'm not going to try to fucking tell you the entire game or, you know, all that, but I'm just trying to show you, you know, how useful a bot can be. And I'm really thinking like, yes, we've come this far with technology now that bots, you know, uh, that tag along with you, they don't have to be bothersome or fucking uh, useless. They can be very useful and it can be, you know, almost like people with emotions and like that, like Elizabeth. I mean, she's very, uh, I think she's really, uh, one of the first characters that I was like, yeah, that's what, oh. See, and she doesn't, uh, get in the way, and if she is, she immediately moves. And that's pretty cool. <laughs> if you shoot him in the face, you get that tune, like, <laughs> 
You're a killer. Yeah, well, it w I could have let them kill me, but that would have sucked, you know. Really? Wow. Yeah, let's get some more help. Oh, really? Is that what the doctor ordered? No silver bar. Lockpick. As you can see, you know, lockpicks you can find. Usually it just takes, uh, you know, look around a bit, so don't worry about that. Oh, that's a pistol. Don't need that. Now, and of course you can also find health and other shit in that. Yeah. But usually if you don't find something, oh, like shut up. I prefer to keep the carbine. Elizabeth is also very good at finding stuff, you know, sometimes when you walk in. Oh shit. The Boxer Rebellion. Okay, this is kind of racist here. What is this? It's the Boxer Rebellion. What happened there? Holy shit. Really? Employees only, really? Winter shield, okay. A little peek. Well, anyway, you kind of. Oh. Show yourself. Really? Well, I'm not the best at this shooting, but I think you already figured that out. You know. You kind of get an idea of what you can see. Yellow, really? Yellow skin? You can't just call them Asian? Really? Ask George Washington. I'm not saying George Washington was a saint, but this kind of, you know... Are those real hats on Spider? Did you? No? A soldier's death? You've been watching way too much uh, Gladiator, dude. Burn in hell? You first. Oh, soldier's death. Head gets blown off. Oh, really, dude? You missed. Wait a second. You're dead now, bitch. Now, as you can see. The true patriots, really? You're a guy on a fucking speaker talking bullocks. Okay. Well, so far, so good. Oh, thanks a lot. As you can see, once again, Elizabeth keeps me stuck with ammo. And the same counts, by the way, for health, but I don't think I've been in that much trouble just yet. But trust me, if you fuck up too much and you're in need of health, then Elizabeth will, you know, throw you something. That's pretty cool. Well, I think, uh, you probably got the idea now, uh, how good a bot can be. And actually, I think this game totally proves it, Bioshock Infinite, once again, in case you forgot. It is incredibly awesome how cool bots can be. And, I mean, if I look at games like uh, Payday 2 or um, 
well, technically any other game where there are bots, you know, following you around and like that. They're usually never as good as uh, as, Elith uh, as Elizabeth in uh, Bioshock in, uh, Infinite. And that's really something I need to see in more games and maybe even better. I mean, Elizabeth is not perfect, but she is pretty cool. And, you know, make it happen, you know, uh, I'm just saying. And Anyway, that's just uh, my little uh, speech about that. But, you know, as you can see, Elizabeth uh, is pretty cool. And I could really uh, say that she's probably one of the best bots, if not the best, that I've ever had to accompany me. And that says a lot, because I had a lot of fun with the Mass Effect ones, but they're not as useful as Elizabeth. And that's just the way it is. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the next episode.